Just op no, open up and look. There's a picture. Where was that? Here. Where? Right there on the floor in the living room. Camp Adventures. That is disgusting. I know. Oh my god. I am very tired right now. So, um, I'm leaving the fridge and the freezer to Josh. Is that fine? You okay. at least cleaned the drawer out. I did do that, and it's back in there. <laughs> you wanna know why we need I did everything that on that list, but the fridge and Why are you very tired today? Because that's a lot of work you put on there. <laughs> you know what? It's been hell, okay? Your bathroom we've, we've had good. <laughs> we've had a rough night. And now right. we're all trying to find food and trying to get shit together. Mm -hmm. and are you actually going to take both cans? The old can that you left here twice and the new one? Out. Yes, and now I'm going to look stupid because I have three cans <laughs> in my diaper bag. You want to know what Josh I'm all set. Said. Josh said, well, maybe, maybe you don't need it. <laughs> yeah. I asked her today if I could start using it. Hi. That's a, that's a good thing because I'm... Hi. Hey, oh my it's food. It would fill me up. So get this Whoa. money. Yes. Good job. It always gets complicated with us. So we had uh, a three-bedroom apartment that we were going to look at today. Uh, and right as we were getting to the place where we needed to be, Zach got a call. And the apartment was just signed. So now we're going to go to one in North Mankato that she's showing us. Yeah, sorry, kind of cut you off there, but, um, I was waiting for Zach to find me where I was parked at, because we had gotten separated at one point when they got the phone call that, uh, the place we were going to see had been taken, so, uh, but we went to go look at this other place, which was a two-bedroom, and when we got there and the lady realized that there was three of us, she said, there's no way that they will let three people live there. And once we got in there, there would be no way that I could make it work there. My chair doesn't even, doesn't fit into the bathroom at all. No way, shape, or form. You'd have to knock out about a foot and a half of the wall for me to be able to use that bathroom. And then... On top of that, I can't even make it into the bedrooms, so that place is definitely a no-go for me. Nice. And uh, when uh, Mel is asking about a few simple little modifications to the place, uh, the gal was like, They're, they won't do anything like that. They won't do anything to transform the place. They will not make it an accessible unit, you know, and about the only thing, you know, she asked for about two things, like one thing that Zach said, you know, would it be possible to take the bathroom door off so that, you know, we have a little bit more room because, you know, we had to do that in the place we're in now, and she's like, I would think they wouldn't have a problem with that. But I'd have to check and get back to you. And then Mel asked, you know, in the kitchen, could, is there any way we could get the cabinet doors taken off underneath the sink? And she's like, no, they won't do that. They won't make it accessible. And then she said, is there any way that we could get a different oven put in? Because this oven and stovetop has the dials at the very back of the stove and Mel can't feel like hot and cold on her skin so if she's reaching over a hot burner to grab a dial she's not going to know if she's burning herself so and she's like nope they will not do that so pretty much a no go but that kind of sucks because it's literally about two blocks from the place that Mel and I go to PT, and I have a, an appointment there at 3 o'clock, and it's about quarter to 2 right now, so I'm going to go piddle around in Walgreens for a bit, probably hit up their bathroom, 
and then I'll probably find something else to do to pill around somewhere. Damn, do they love to torture me at PT. Oof. Oh well. Uh, I'm, right now, I'm sitting outside of the MVAC thrift store. I'm gonna pop in here, because they gave me, uh, a little bit of a cardio workout to do, to help keep my, get my heart rate up and stuff, and, uh, we're just going to try, when I was here the other day, sorry, there was a car that I was slightly concerned was going to hit me, so, but, um, uh, when I was here the other week, uh, trying to find a thing for Zach's, uh, birthday present, they had a couple weights here that they were selling for, like, 50 cents, so I was gonna come hop in here and see if they would happen to have those, uh, if they do, sweet, if not, Oh well. So I'm gonna pop in here and see if they happen to have them yet. So, well, I didn't find the weight that I wanted, but I think I found a shirt for my Halloween costume. Awesome. <laughs> Good job, dude. Oh my god. <laughs> That's what you get for licking food color. Mmm. <laughs> tie dye cake. Happy birthday. Mm -hmm. So here, here's the finished all custom head tie dye cake, and everybody's loud. Stupid people. We're disabled. That's right. I just have Mindy. You are not disabled. Actually, she is. You're special. She is disabled. She has ADHD. She's special. We love her though. I'm. I'm. This is true. Adventures, making our way one push at a time.